to Watch It Played. My name is Monique. And I'm Naveen. And today we're going to be playing the two to five player game Disney Gargoyles Awakening, designed by Nate Heiss and published by Ravensburger, who are helping sponsor this video. Join us as we play through one of four different scenarios uh, while we try to reach our goal before losing. Before we lose, <laughs> yeah. We don't want to do that. Yeah. And so before we get started, if you're interested in learning how to play this game, Rodney's already made a tutorial video for it, which is linked in the description below. And if you're interested in other gameplay videos, just like this one, we make more of them over on our own YouTube channel called Before You Play, which is also linked in the description. Now we're gonna do our absolute best to not make any mistakes, but just in case we do, we do recommend that you turn on your Klingon subtitles, because if we do make those mistakes, we'll add those corrections there. And I think that's it. That's it. All right. So if you please direct your attention to the center of the table, we are all set up here for our two-player game of Disney Gargoyles Awakening. Mm -hmm. Today, we're going to be playing through scenario number three, which is called Information Warfare. I am going to be playing as Elisa. And so my special is that I have a range of three whenever I use my basic attack. I can also move up to two spaces for free after attacking, which is pretty cool. And for my skill here, it says that after any hero has rolled for an attack, they can reroll any number of dice once for that attack before dealing damage. So that Very can nice. be pretty useful. That's pretty good. Okay, and I'm going to be playing as Goliath, and I'm this little character right over here, that kind of Peter Blue. <laughs> the main gargoyle. The main gargoyle, yes. And my special is if I roll one of those lightning bolts, it basically acts as a hit. So that's pretty nice. Yeah, I'm that is pretty really nice. strong. My skill here says that the active hero, meaning either myself or Monique, gets a plus two strength for a maximum of five total. Nice. Yeah. I like that. Gotta so, get you some skill. I need tokens. to find something, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And so for today's scenario, you may notice that there are three data disks kind of hidden around the city, and these disks contain Xanatos' evil plans. And so we need to get them to the police building over here. These are floppy disks, yes. by the way. <laughs> they are. It's a different time. Yes. And so we win if we can get all three of these data disks to the police building before either one of us goes down in health all the way to zero, or Xanatos gets these disks back to this building. So that is a big no-no. Yes, it's kind of like Capture the Flag almost. Almost. We also have some almost. steel clans, and so I don't think they have those in Capture the Flag. No. And if you haven't noticed, Xanatos will start here on this building. We also have the Eye of Odin. Mm -hmm. And uh, if we can claim that token, it'll get us an extra action per turn. It's pretty well defended right now. It is. Yeah. So we'll see about that. Mm -hmm. But I think we're ready to begin. Sure. Yep. So this is a fully cooperative game, and Naveen wanted to go first. So take it away, Naveen. Thank you. Uh, so I have three actions, uh, and I definitely want to get to this data disk right over here, because I think you and I, we're going to divide and conquer. Yes. Yeah, because uh, a lot of these baddies, they're going to move towards uh, one of us, so it'd be nice if we can kind of split them yeah. up. Yeah, you go so here and I go there? I'm pretty sure, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, and we didn't mention this, but mm -hmm. on your turn, as a basic action, you can spend an action point to push an adjacent data disk one space. Yes, we don't actually so, grab these. For some no. reason, we are pushing they, them and sliding them across You can't the, pick them up. The ground. So you got to find your way somewhere in this vicinity. Yeah. All right. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to glide, which for me gets me four spaces to move. Mm -hmm. I can move diagonal. So I'm going to go one, two, three, four, just like nice. that. So that's one action point. I have yep. two action points remaining. I'm going to move for two. I'm going to go one, two. Okay. And now I'm adjacent to this uh, data disk over here. And for one last action point, I am going to slide it a little bit closer to our building over here. Nice. That's me. So that that's, those are all three of your action points. That right? is, and I didn't even use any of the three cards that I started the game with because I knew that's exactly what I wanted to do. I like it. Yes. So villain phase, ready? Yes. Here we what go. What do do to us? Okay. We have <clears throat> laser blast. This okay. is going to be one of our crescent moons. Okay. Our villain is going to move for two spaces. Now they're going to move towards the closest hero. Do you think you're closer or am I closer? I'm pretty sure I'm closer. You think? Yeah, you're probably right. Mm -hmm. So they're going to move two spaces towards uh, you. Okay, yeah, sure. <laughs> so, so they are going to move one, two, right over there. Yeah. All right. And uh, They got some distance on me. And he's also supposed to attack afterwards with a range of three, but uh, clearly he cannot reach either of us, so yep. we're just going to skip that. Mm -hmm. And the card says no additional effect. Good. So that was a pretty smooth villain phase. I, I like am good with that. where we're going here. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, and you still have the three cards in your head? I still so have no, three cards, no drawing up. No clean up. All okay. right, so my turn. Okay, so I think I'm just going to move twice because unfortunately uh, the data disk is too far for me to reach in just one movement. Mm -hmm. So it's going to be a little bit of a waste. But so I one can action move... point movement gets you, what, three spaces? Three spaces. Okay. Yeah. So it's not too bad. So we're going to go one, two, three, okay. and then one, two. Right. So I am going up a building. Yes. And then with my third action point, I am going to take that basic action that allows me to push the data disk one space 
I mean, any direction. So I'm just going to stand on top of it yeah, and good. hope that nobody takes it. <laughs> All right, so that's me. Let's go with the villain phase. Ready? Okay, what do they got? Oh, another moon symbol. Okay. It's a contingency plan. Sure. So Xanatos is moving to F7. Okay, so we have F, and then I believe 7 is here. Oh, they got way closer to me. Okay. Oh, okay. I don't like it. And then... Uh, no attack. Good. It says, actually, no. Sorry. Oh, okay. <laughs> Make a two strength attack against each hero who is at or adjacent to at least one data disc. Wow. That's both of us. That's both of us, yeah. Okay. Well, do you want to go first? Sure, since I'm the closest, closest. So it's a two strength, so yeah. I'm going to roll these two dice. And okay, I take one hit. Uh, okay. Okay, that's fine. I will take I mean, you have a, a starting health of eight. I do have so a starting health of eight, but. That's not bad. I have six. Yes. Good luck. Thank you. Uh, gosh, come on. Zero. Double miss. Okay, okay, you take one also. All one right, one right. is okay. Yeah. And this the... dice, the distribution, just for heads up, is 50-50. Uh, so 50% you will get hit, 50% you won't. And then one of the, the die faces is that lightning bolt. Okay, so, and the nice thing is, even though we took some damage, we are 50% of the way to a daytime scenario. That's true, yeah. Where you can heal a little bit. To heal. Mm -hmm. Depending on, yeah, I think everybody gets a heal. Yep. So it is back to you then. All right, uh, maybe I should just move this thing and then um, take the damage of whatever they're going to do to me. So I'm trying would, to haul it yeah. as far as you can. I'm just going to chuck it. Yeah, so we're going to go one. Okay. Two. And then uh, I have a two move, so we're just going to go one, two. I'm just going to camp on top of it. <laughs> You're just going to like push yeah. and then run up to it? Like now I'm going to face the baddie right here, just so that they know that, I, that I mean Zanatos is watching business. you. All right, ready for your villain face? Uh, yes. Here we go. We have oh. the Robo Suit Combat. Oh. So, oh no, this is bad. This is really bad. Xanatos is going to move three. Okay. So. He's going to run up on me. Yeah, he will continue <laughs> to move until until he's adjacent to yeah, you. Yeah, so we go one, two, yeah. he's right next to me. And then now he's going to attack you at a strength of three, but the caveat here is he uses this attack twice. Oh my gosh. Yeah, if he rolls a lightning bolt, you place a new steel clan token adjacent to Xanatos. Ooh, this is bad, bad, bad. Well, okay. Good luck. So I take, I, wow. Oh, okay. Good luck. Oh my gosh. Okay, so I'm going to growl, and this is a reactionary card. And basically, what this says is I get to reduce the damage taken by one. So instead of Sweet. taking two damage, I will only take one damage. Nice. I do need that card, but it's gone. All right, so that goes here. Well, and at then... least you can get your card flow going. Yeah. Right? Yeah. And then here we go. We're going to go. And <laughs> do it again. Come on. Come I'm, on willing to, I'm willing to take. One damage. Oh. oh! Maybe next time let's not tell them what we're willing to take. <laughs> yeah. Uh, That's a lot. So I'm going to take two damage, plus we're going to spawn one of those things. Yeah. Okay. So I I one, think two. you get to decide where it goes, as long as it's adjacent to Zeta. Yeah, so we're going we're gonna to definitely want to spawn this all the way over here, <laughs> as far away as I can. All right. On the rooftops. Well... That was unfortunate. Wow. What is your health right now? Uh, my health is a four, so okay. I'm halfway there. Hopefully we can heal soon. Gotta protect Naveen somehow. Please. Yeah, help me. Okay, <laughs> so it's back to me. The thing is, if you uh, defeat Xanatos, he goes back to this tower and he's going to regenerate his health, but you get to skip the villain phase. Yeah, Xanatos so... starts with five health, so you have to really beat him up. You know what? Just stay alive, because I'm going to try to move the data disk. Sure, yeah. Okay, so one action. I'm going to plop this data disk down. So okay. we are getting closer. Uh, action number two. two, and then I just got to, I have to move. Maybe just go like one, two, three, and just be there, and then kind of just yeah. bring it in. One, two, three. Yeah, that's nice that you get to move three. Yeah, it's not bad. All right, here we go with the villain phase. Let's hope Naveen survives it. <laughs> we survive it. So this is the Steel steel Clan Strike. Oh, okay. Oh, no, here we go. So, we, oh, this is bad. We've, we've largely been ignoring the Steel Clan up to now. And so now we no have longer. to activate them. Mm -hmm. All of them will get activated. Um, and this isn't even a crescent moon. So no. we're not even closer to daytime. No. But they all get activated according to the parameters on their token. So that's going to be a movement of three with an attack of two. A two distance attack, yeah, okay. No, it's, just, it's an oh, attack, just attack of two. two. So mm -hmm. there's no range indicated, so right. we assume that it's adjacent. Adjacent, yep. Which means you're probably gonna get attacked by. I definitely will be attacked by that one. By that one. Do you wanna do that one first? Yeah, let's just get through it. So we're gonna go one, two. Yep. Okay, and then uh, it's gonna hit me for two. I mean, I think it technically stops there, because yeah. it's adjacent. Yeah, that's true. Good luck. Oh. Well. Uh... <laughs> 
that's pretty bad. So we are down to just two health and I am in big trouble. So if Naveen goes down to zero health, we are going to lose Correct. the game. So you need to abandon that data disc. I need to just leave. Yeah. Uh, but we're not done. We have some other uh, some other steel clan to activate. Yeah, they are going to move. I think these two will move towards you. Yeah, I think so. Right. So this is just going to go one, two, three, and one, two, three. Sure. They will probably move towards me. I would imagine. Yeah. So they will probably move diagonally then towards yeah. me. So one, two, three. Yep. And uh, for this specific scenario, neither Xanatos nor the steel clans have to spend two movements to go up a building, unlike right. us. Unlike us, yeah. So it's kind of nice for them. Yeah. <laughs> and they go one, two, uh, three, right? Yes. So. Yeah, I, I'm in bad shape here. This this might be this might be it. Do you have anything up your sleeve? No. <laughs> you can't move? Nothing. Uh-oh. All right, well, I get to draw a card because I did play that reactionary card. So I oh, have yeah. Three. That should have been done at the end of your turn, actually. Okay, all right. Okay, so like the plan we said was uh, I'm going to try to bail, and uh, but I kind of want to do some damage to Xanatos on my way out. Yeah, you should. Yeah, so I'm going to play this card into the fray, and this will allow me to move and do some uh, some attack. So it's going to allow me to move up to two spaces away. I'm only going to be able to move one space away because I do need this little distance here, mm -hmm. but it allows me to then attack also instead of taking just two attack actions. So let's nice. do it. So come on, I need two hits. One hit. Okay, so Xanathos takes one hit. Okay. And then now, oh, I think I gotta do a double move. What do you think? Yeah, I guess so. I just gotta move, try to move. just run away. Yeah, I think so. Because had I gotten two, maybe I would have done my regular attack, which is three, because then it would have been the five that we need. But I, I'm not feeling very good about this. Let's bail. Okay, so <laughs> I'm gonna do my move for my second action point. Okay. So that's one, two. Uh -huh. And then I'm gonna move again. One, two. I'm just going to tuck down into A10. <laughs> into A10? Yes, oh my up gosh. into a corner. So let's just see what this villain has up his sleeve. Oh, All right. Good luck. This come, might be the end. <laughs> come on. Nap time. Okay. We have uh, objective locked. Okay. Uh oh. Oh, this is good. So Xanatos moves four spaces towards the nearest data disk. <laughs> okay. So just go around top. Yeah. Okay. If he lands on a disk, stop moving and move that data disk two spaces towards the Eerie building. Okay, so then it's going to go probably one, two, like that, right? Yeah, Would you agree I think with that? so. Uh, but the good news is uh, there are no attacks happening. You're going to survive this. And it will get a and heal eventually. the next, next one, next villain phase is going to be daytime, where okay. you can heal for a little bit. Okay. All right, so I'm going to try to get my data disc back to the police building. I'm so close, so it's going to be one. Yep. I think, is this, is this directly adjacent? So yep. this is two. So That's that. the building. That's it. It made it. Yes. So I have one more action to spare. Uh, what are you What are you gonna do? <laughs> I don't know if I can. Maybe you can start with your move. You can like move one, two, three, or something, so you can kind of position yourself to get there. Maybe you can get that Odin's eye. Kind of like the back door plan. Yeah. Right. Just evading all the steel clan. Yeah. Let's do it. Okay. So I'm gonna move uh, three spaces. I think it's just diagonally, yeah. right? So one, one two, two, three. three. There you go. I'm hiding. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So. It is daytime okay. because we have all four crescent moons showing, so we are not going to do a typical villain phase. Right. We are first going to read what it says here. So during daytime, Xanatos moves four spaces towards the nearest the nearest data disk. Okay, so he's going to go one, two. Yes, if he lands off, there, right? he'll stop and moves it two spaces towards the Eerie building. All oh, right. Oh, gosh. So then it's just one, two. It's on it's further away yeah. than when we started the game. Wow. <laughs> wow, wow. And now we're going to place three new Steel Clan tokens oh, at the okay. building. So all those three that we have in the supply, we're just going to have we full were... maximum Steel Clan capacity in this city. <laughs> yeah, we are. <laughs> this is not good. One, two, and three. Oh my gosh. That's your backdoor entrance. And now we're just going to shuffle all the discarded cards back into their deck. Mm -hmm. And we'll do our daytime stuff. So for me, I can discard any number of cards, and I think you can yeah, too, so, right? Uh -huh. So choose any cards from your hand that are not that great. Okay, I... Ooh. Oh, these are all pretty great. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I like them. So I, I discard, and then I take my discard, and then I, I reshuffle. So let's just go ahead yeah, and see. Yeah, reshuffle your discard pile. I could really use that growl. That growl was nice. Uh, and then we can heal. So I get to heal for two which is just going to bring me back to my max of six. I healed for three, which takes me up to five. So here we go. Okay. But the kicker is we each get, or oh, I get a skill token. Sorry, you don't have. Huh? I do not oh, get a skill token. I don't get a I kicker. I gain a skill <laughs> token. So nice. That's now good. we have that. 
Right. Um, and what does yours do again? If anybody has rolled for an attack, I can spend my skill token to allow that person to re-roll any number of dice. Nice. Okay. Yeah. That's, that's, so that's pretty that's nice. that's going to be helpful. Yeah. Now that I'm slightly healed up, I need to find my way back into the battle. So uh, <laughs> let's not put myself in too much harm's way, but... We got to clear off. The, there's seven of these people out here. We, oh, man, we can't have <laughs> they that. They are Steel Clan. <laughs> They're pretty. Can I get that right? Steely, yeah. So uh, one action point. We're gonna go one, two, two action point. We're gonna go three, four, oh. and now we are gonna do my basic attack of three and try to attack this one right here. What do you think? Yeah, I like it. Let's do it. All you right. gotta get one of them off. I gotta get one of them off. Yeah. Good luck. Okay, so this is one attack that is successful. And then anytime I roll a lightning bolt, it automatically turns into this. Nice. So we have cleared this one yes. off the board. Oh, that's a little bit of relief. A little bit. Hopefully we don't <laughs> have a card that activates these guys and they all come and just gang up on me. But well, we are going to see. We'll find out. Ready? Yes. Okay, here we go. <laughs> Big time. Uh, okay. Is this the robo suit? Oh, so... no. That thing again? <laughs> yeah, oh, Xanatos going to attack twice. Oh, no. Uh, so Xanatos moves three spaces towards you. Oh, great. One, two, three. Yep. And then uh, <laughs> he's going to attack you for three. Twice. Yes. Oh. Do not roll a lightning bolt, Naveen. Just roll misses. Oh. I mean, that's not bad. <laughs> yeah. You just place that um, steel clan. The one I just killed? Adjacent to Xanatos. Okay. We'll just put him over here. Okay. Amazing. That was awesome. So do it again. Okay. Well, so even if I roll a lightning bolt, we literally have no more of these uh, steel clan yeah. uh, tokens. Yeah, that would be best. That case would be best case scenario. scenario. Kind of. You just get a bunch of misses. Don't roll any claws. Two. Two claws. Oh boy. Okay. Well, well the writing's kind of on the wall, right, Monique? <laughs> Naveen, stay out of harm's way. I, I mean, you gotta. You. Hmm. Uh, I have. These... I, mean, I have to go in there. I can't just like stay at a ten. I wish I could heal you, but I cannot. No. It's not how stone works. No. <laughs> well, it's back to me. Yes. And maybe I should just, you know, maybe I should come over to you and help with uh, with Xenatos. I'm going to do it. All I'm right. going to attack Xenatos. Let's do Because it. even if I do that, I will be a little bit closer to that data disk. Sure. So I could get working on that one. Right. So I'm first going to move. Okay. So one, two, three. Okay. Right in there. So that's one action. So you have two actions. Yes. Then... I'm going to play my defensive position. Okay. This card does not cost any actions. It has a range of three, but I am adjacent to Xenatos now. So I'm just going to um, attack oh, for two. allows you to attack for two. Nice. Yeah, okay. strength of two. Perfect. All right. Good luck. I'm hoping for a, a double hit two here. Two claws. Come on. Okay. One claw. One claw. Okay. I'll take it. That all was right. a free attack after all. It was. So three more health. And you have two more actions still because that was free. Oh, uh, right. Right. As your character, every mm -hmm. time you attack, you get a free two move. Right. I don't really want to move away yeah. from him, though. Okay. Uh, I would like to continue to attack. Sure. Yeah, I don't. I can't use these cards. So okay. I'm going to do my basic attack twice, then. Okay. Um, and my basic attack is two. Two. All right. Same thing again. Yes. So we need to get three hits out of these four die rolls. Okay. I do have my skill token. If you need to. Worst case scenario. Hopefully you don't. Okay, another one. That's one. Okay. Ooh. Okay, I will deal the one. Yeah. And then if I need to, then I can send my skill token on the next one. Yeah, so just, good luck. Oh, boy. Just, I, need, I just need two. We need two. two. We need two out of two. There we go. Wow. Nice. Wow. That was awesome. Okay. Okay, so, so that's it. You damaged Xanatos. My skill token. Good. So Xanatos goes back to this building. And Tuck them away. Yeah. And he's going to go back to his normal uh, five health. Okay, good. Good, and good. that's it. So we're going to skip the vi the villain phase, nice. which is now, technically. I've spent all my actions. Sure. But I still get to do my refresh, so I'm going to mm -hmm. draw a card. And it's back to you. So now you can do what... I mean, you don't have to run away, per se. No. But you don't have to worry about him right now. Yeah, I feel like I should take out some of these uh, minions here. Okay, so for my action, I'm going to play the aerial strike. It costs me one of my action points. I get mm. two movement, and so I'm going to move one, two. I think I'm going to go. I'm going to try to go around this way. Okay. Don't like the fact that he's up here again, but we've switched places. I'm going to do this one. Yeah. I'm gonna do that one. Okay. okay. Uh, so now I get a three attack with a one range, so I can do this right here. Mm -hmm. So uh, let's go ahead and do it. Nice. All right. So. Yeah, I think two. if you were on a building, then that would have given you additional strength. Yes, exactly. Because you're not... It's, it's just my standard. Just the standard. Okay, perfect. So it's one, two, and then this lightning bolt would be yes, a third, so, so this, three. Definitely got it. The steel plan is out. Out. That's nice. One less. Yeah, so that was uh, one action. 
Now, you know what? I think I will just do my regular move. One, two, and then just do an attack of three to this one right here. Oh. What do you think? You want to... I thought you wanted to go back that way. I, I feel like we need to clear off some of these minions because they're 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 guarding this. Don't forget, we the data disk is right below this one here. Sure. So, I mean, if I go this way, all I'm doing is then being a sitting running duck. Away. <laughs> I, well... <laughs> I'm running away, but I'm running also into a very close just move for Xanatos. If, Xanatos, if it says, like, Xanatos moves four. Okay, if you want to go there. Yeah, let's just clear some of these minions out. Sure. All right, so a second action point is going to be one, two, and then my third one is going to be to attack, which is a strength of three. So let's Come on. get it. Two damage. One damage. All right, so that's not good. That's not ideal. <laughs> so we're going to flip that over. Uh... I'm a sitting duck. Okay. This is this is the the duck uh, scenario that you yeah. were trying to avoid. Uh, yep. Ready? Yep. Uh, objective locked. Okay. So Xanatos is just going to move four spaces towards the nearest data disk. It doesn't say anything about what if the data disk is at the building. This is so the nearest one, right there. That is the nearest one. I like that card. If he lands on a disk, stop moving and move that data disk two spaces towards the eerie building. It's already on the building. Yes. So that's a great card. That's a fantastic card. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Uh, so then it's back to me. That's the card we were looking for. Naveen, should I start moving that? Yeah. Or do you want me to start defeating some baddies? If you can defeat some baddies, maybe we should clear it out. And then and then now we can maybe just really focus on this disc and then focus on the third disc after. Oh my gosh, I just realized. What? I have a range of three. Three. When I use my basic attack. <laughs> there have probably been a lot of opportunities there where I probably could have helped you out a little bit more. That's okay. I'm so sorry. I realized but... I never drew my card, by the way. Oh, okay. So there you go. Yep. Well... Now that we've realized this, I'm going to use it. Okay. Um, I am over here, and I can essentially attack either of these. Yeah. Uh, I would plans. attack the person on the disc. You know what? I'm going to attack this one. Sure. Get this one out because they are adjacent to you now. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So, so... You get to roll two dice still, though, right? Yes. My okay. attack is still a strength of two. Okay. But you have a three distance. Yeah. Hopefully, I can knock this one out. Perfect. Yes. You did. Okay. So, so this that's one's out. out. And then the this doesn't do anything for you, right? No, the lightning bolts don't. Okay. But I also get to move two spaces for free after attacking. Perfect. So where should I go? You want to run up on that disc? Should I just go here? Uh, I Yeah, you can. Let's go one, two. Okay. Okay, so that was one action. One action. The I get free two move. more. Yeah. You know what you can do? You could push it one. And then attack. And then attack. Okay. It, and then... And then move. Get a free move. Okay, I'm going to push the data disc one that way, and okay. then I'm going to attack. This seal clan. All right, come on. Two claw marks. Two claw marks. Two Let's claw go. marks. One. One. <laughs> ah, man. Uh, wait, I can spread this. Is this the time? I'm thinking maybe when I go and do like a big battle with Xanatos. Oh, that's yeah. When you... This allows you to reroll any, any number, number of, of dice. dice. So yeah. if you have like an attack strength of five, yeah. Exactly. We're not yeah. going to use it yet. Yeah. Okay, so then um, yeah, I get to move moves, two spaces. I'm going to go one, two. Yeah. What do you think? I like it. Okay. Yeah, stay away. All right, so here, let's right. go with the villain phase. Villain phase, what do you got, villain? Laser blast. Okay. Xanatos moves Ooh. two spaces. And they're going to definitely, he's going to definitely attack me. All right, so it's going to go one, two. Yeah. He has a range of three, which okay. is perfect, and an attack strength of five. Oh. So this could very well be the end of me, actually. <laughs> yeah. Because, You moved, well, but... No, not yeah. yet, because I have health of six. You did, yeah. Okay. There are no lightning bolt effects. All right. Blanks. Come on. Okay, no, that's not good. bad. Two hits. We'll take two hits for, for potential five. That, okay. That's great. That could have been so and much The card's worse. now out, and we're getting closer to a heal, so yeah, that's kind of good. Granted, it helps Xanatos also to get to daytime. Well, disc. now I can reach him. Yeah, you so can. So if I, if I can that's right. bring down his health points, then we can skip another villain phase. That's true. So... Okay, so it's back to you. Back to me. All right. So now you have options. I, yeah, I do. Okay, so I think I'm going to play this card. It's called Heroic Charge, and it cost me two of my three action points, but it allows me to move three spaces. So I'm just going to move actually two. One, two, because I do want to be next to this disc. Uh -huh. Actually, I want to be just maybe here, so that if we move it, I can move it a couple more times. Uh, and then I get a four attack with a one range. So I'm going to attack Xanatos for four right now. Okay. So let's do it. Come on. Yes. Lightning bolts are, are Get hitting out. me. Okay, that's two. two. Uh, are you going to take it? Yeah, yeah, let's do it, right? Because my next attack is going to be for three, so we're just okay. going to go for it. So, ah, that wasn't, I wanted at least three hits. <laughs> Not satisfying? No, because now my next one has to be perfect. So now you're going to do a basic attack. Basic right? attack Strength with of three. three. Well, let's go. 
Oh, okay. So we're spending this. Yeah. So I'm going to keep the one. Yeah. And re-roll just those so, two. So uh, he does take a hit for one. But... Oh, no. This is going to be bad. You have to you have to make it. I do. Okay. Oh, oh yes. yes. Oh, my gosh. Uh, I was so nervous. So this is the one that I held back. Two, three. Okay. There we go. So Xanatos is out temporarily. Yeah. And um, we set his health back to five. Back to five. But okay. that's it. Those are all your actions. That was me. Yeah. So okay. we do skip uh, the phase Skipping there. The villain so phase. I do get to draw a card. Oh, and... no. It's unfortunate. I'm not adjacent to the. I debated staying on that spot, but. Oh. That's okay. What Let's just shame. start pulling that disc if we can. Okay, so then I'm going to attack first, now that we have this newfound range. <laughs> yes, the range of three. Uh, the range of three. Yeah. One, two, three. So I'm going to attack this uh, Steel Clan. Yes, perfect. For a strength of two. Okay. If it we just... can get him out, that would be fantastic. That'd be great, yeah. um, regardless, it'll give me a free move so I can get closer to that data disc. Exactly. Come on, just one. Perfect. Okay, okay nice. You got nice. him. Got him, got him. Okay, good. And that gives me a free two move, so one... What do you think, too? Uh, you know what? On top of it? You, you can just hang out here because then your pull could be Oh, one. yes. Yeah. I can pull twice. What yeah. was I thinking? And uh, just stay away from the baddies and then yeah. we can figure out the baddies after we get the... I think we just need to get this disc back home. Yeah, I think so. So yeah. that's going to be the rest of my actions. It's going to be one, two. Yeah, perfect. And you are now still And now I can then it. do something, yeah. So that's perfect. We're like guarding the day-to-day. Oh, uh, we're trying, yeah. <laughs> okay, villain phase. All right, villain, what do you got? Uh, where are you going? A contingency oh, plan no. is what he has. So he's moving to F7. Yeah, which is this one right here. Oh, here we go. Oh, no. And it's going to be a two-strength attack against each hero who is at <laughs> or adjacent to at least one... We've seen this card. ...data disc. Why we is know that about always... It. Oh, all right. always such good timing. Since it's your active action, here, we'll have you go. But all the moons are up. Yep. So we're going to have a nice uh, daytime refreshed, gain some health. Yeah. But before that can happen, we have to do this. Okay, so you're going to so, roll for two attack. Here we go. Oh my gosh! Wow. That stinks. That okay, does stink. so I'm down to two health. All right. I only have three health, so this is really bad. Okay, so one hit for yeah. me. Oh boy. Oh boy, 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 boy. Okay, so we're not looking too good. No, we're looking hurt. But the good news is we do have that daytime, the daytime uh, phase next we do. turn. So just try to push the day to day. Yeah, I think what so. What do you think? <laughs> yeah, I think so. All right, first action. Data disc is going to get pushed. Second action, I think I'm going to go one, two, move. Oh my gosh, you're so close. Uh, third action, data disc push, right? And then I'm just going to sit here and take the hit, I guess. I mean, I, oh. Xanatos is right there, but you're closer in range, so you're going to take the hits first. I don't know. Well, Xanatos is actually <laughs> right now because we're going to do the villain phase. Right. It's daytime. Xanatos is going to move four spaces towards that data disk, and I think he's going to make it. Wow, amazing. One, two, three. Just yeah. right on it. Uh, so <laughs> you move it two spaces towards the Erie building. Okay. So towards the Erie building would mm -hmm. be probably one, two, right? Yeah, yeah I okay. think so. Anything else, Xanatos? Uh, three new Steel Clan tokens. Oh, boy. At the Erie building? The, the is there enough yeah, space? Yeah, one. Oh, no. Two, and... Uh, there's three that you have to add put place it right there. Oh yeah, there you go. Because I think I'm gonna just go over there oh my and start God. pushing that disc, and then we shuffle this. So now you and I get to do our day phase. Yeah. So would you like to discard any of your cards? Yes. We fortunately haven't had to activate the Steel Clan in a while, so. Yeah, I'm gonna discard all those, but then I have to reshuffle everything, and then draw <laughs> until I have three cards. I'm gonna keep my hand. Okay. I think it's it's not bad. I do need so, to heal for three. Yes, How and I am so? going to heal for two. Okay, good. So now I'm back to four. Four, yeah, okay. <laughs> not full. I have five. And I get a skill token. Oh, nice. Yeah, that's perfect. Yes. That's good. Best part of the so day. you can re-roll, yeah. Yeah. Oh, and this actually, uh, your discard gets shuffled back. Yep. Yeah, I did that. Into your draw pile. All right, so back to me. You know what? I'm just going to try to hit Xanatos. Okay. And get him away from you yeah, so that Xanatos. you can... Move the data disc over. I'm so close to that disc. Yeah, that'd be yeah. great. So I'm going to play my critical hit card. It's going to cost me three actions. All your actions. So all my actions. But it is a an attack strength of five with a range of three. Oh, nice. Okay. And Ooh, if I yeah. yeah, if I roll a lightning bolt, then we both get a skill token. We don't want that. We want you to roll all claws. Fortunately, I have for that it. skill token now, though. Yeah. All right. Good luck. Thanks. Claws. As many claws as possible, please. Here we go. 
Three. Three. Okay. Okay. So we're looking for a perfect score here, huh? Yeah, so you're not going to take this one right here, right? No, I'm going to yeah, re-roll it. Re-roll it. Yeah, you're looking for a perfect score. Ugh. That's We've a done it pressure. before. We can do it again. Uh, all right. Here we go. Oh, yes. my God, yes. Wow. Ooh. This is the second time that we did this. That's awesome. Ooh. All right. So that's all five. That's one, five two, three, hits. Four, five. And Xanatos <laughs> is down again. The only reason why we needed to do that was because you had that re-roll. Yeah. That, uh, yeah. Yes. Otherwise, there was no way we were going to go for that. Nice. Nice. Okay. So we skipped Xanatos, which is great. Yeah. But that's it. That's, that's it. my entire turn. So nice. now we're just going back to, to you. <laughs> All right, I think I can get this disc home right now. I hope uh, so. All three actions. So it's going to be one action to push where I am, uh -huh. two to push here, Yep. three to then push here. Yes. It's home. So now all we need to focus on one is more. this last one right here. Uh, it's pretty heavily guarded. Yeah, I was going to say, I will say, it is pretty heavily barricaded. Yeah. I but now we have one focus and that's it. So. Yeah, that's true. Us. Let's see the villain face. Sure. Here we go. Shadowy research. Move each hero not on a building two spaces away from Xanatos. Away? <laughs> yeah. Can't get a, uh, a break. sniff of that research. Yeah, one, two, I guess. And then where are you going to go? You want to go one, two, I guess? I don't want to go that far. I mean, it, you have to go away. It would be nice to stay away from this person right here. Just, I guess just, that's true. It's cheapy. I think you can still go one, two. Yeah, sure, it's still away. Considered away. Yeah, okay. it's away. All right. Wow. I forgot to draw a card, okay. so I'm going to start by drawing a card. And then now, yes, it is my oh, no, that was, turn. That was, uh, yeah. yeah, because I just turn. did the three pull. Yeah, that's yeah. right. So now it goes back to me, and uh, we only have one data disc left. We are a little bit injured, not horribly. Yeah, I, I, uh, wow, we need to get these, uh, these, this gang just to get out of that, that spot right there. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to start by playing a card. This okay. is the Trustworthy Human card. It's going to cost uh, two of my action points, okay. but it allows me to move up to three, which is my normal move, but I can also move each other hero up to three spaces. Oh, nice. So you can kind of go where you want to be. Sure. And we also each gain a seal token. Oh, cool. Okay. I'll take that right nice. away. So I'm playing this card, and I'm going to move three spaces. And I think I'm just going to move uh, in this direction. So I'm going to go one, two, two three. three. Okay. Be, it's nice to be on top of the building. Except I get to move three, right? Yes. Okay, so we're going to go one, two, three. Cool. Just getting a little closer. I do have one more action point, so I think I'm going to attack uh, with my range. And I'm just going to attack that, sure. that yeah. one, right? Good luck. Thanks. Roll that perfect. <laughs> <laughs> it's been happening it a couple has. times, a couple times. Perfect Not today. nothing. Okay, <laughs> all right. So I guess that's that. That's that. Their turn? Yep, villain phase. Steel clan strike. Oh, <laughs> here they <no>. come. <laughs> They're coming. This is This is the end. The end. Yeah. Is That's okay. I'm... Let's start with so basically we activate <laughs> all the steel clans. Oh yeah. So we're gonna go uh one, two. Yep. Then we're gonna go uh one, two. Oh my god. <laughs> Let's just move them all in, right? Yeah. We got a one, two. I must have tripped one, some kind of like a sensor two, as I got closer to the, oh, the yeah. area building. I think we're done, right? This is pretty much it. I think so. And then we got a oh, one, two. So sorry. And uh, let's just go one, two. Well, that one's not going to attack, fortunately. Fortunately. Well, you forgot about this one. Oh, yeah. Come on <laughs> down. Two. Well, you're wow. surrounded. Uh, so attack for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight. Yes. What we can do is we can say these three are attacking you and these three are attacking me. You okay? Instead of you getting attacked four times, might as well three and three split. Okay. I have five health. You have a uh, four. Uh, good luck. Godspeed. Thanks. Okay, I'm gonna roll for this one. Okay. We don't have uh, enough dice for all of them, or else I would have done them all at the same time. One. One. Eight. Oh no. Uh, one's okay. Maybe you won't even have to roll, Naveen. This one. Yeah. Sure. There you go. One. One. Okay. And then this one technically, right? Yeah. Anyway. It just has to not be two claws. Zero. Zero. Great. Okay. I have two health. So now oh. to you. Think you can survive it? Uh, uh, High hopes? Yes. Zero. Okay. Okay, so that's this first one. We're just going to work our way down. Sure. One. I'll take one. One is okay. <laughs> if, I can, if I can get out of this with just one. Yeah. One? Okay. That's great. Wow. Wow, I thought we were done. Oh my gosh, I have a Did card. You, Do I, I have that stun done. card? 
I'm going to draw a card before I forget. Wow. Okay. So all this right, is so good. They, they are away from this building, but I mean, you you are kind of surrounded. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Well, I have this one surprise card. It says stun all enemies adjacent to you. So I can stun one, two, three. Do it. Yeah. So I'm going to stun them. Awesome. That's fantastic. So we're going to turn them 90 degrees. And essentially when that second card, because I believe there's a second uh, activate, activate all steel clan. Yeah. When that comes up again, then they are going to get rotated 90 degrees yeah. and you don't actually activate them. Yeah. So essentially they're not doing anything right yeah, now. Yeah. They just skip one activation. Amazing. Okay, so the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to play that into the fray. This one allows me to move and attack. So mm -hmm. I'm going to move one, two, and attack this one, the one that's not stunned. Because I'd rather not attack the stunned ones. Yeah, you know? that'll be a waste. Okay, so and then this allows me to hit this one for two or attempt a two hit. So if I roll a perfect, that'll be exactly what we need. Okay, yes, that is a perfect for Goliath. Anytime I roll a lightning, uh, lightning bolt. bolt, it is a success. Fantastic. Gone is that one. Okay. Okay, and then the last action, the last action point, I'm just going to go one, two, and kind of hang out here so I can maybe manipulate that disc in the future. Sweet. That's Xanatos me. has no idea that you're yeah. there. Yeah. All right, ready? All right, where are you going, Xanatos? Robo suit combat. Oh, oh no. no. Oh, this is this is it. Is it's this the back. End? This might be the end. <laughs> so Xanatos is going to move three spaces towards you. I'm like, I'm thinking, right? One. Two, three versus yeah. one. Yeah, I'm yeah. Oh, um, horrid. So We've drawn this card way too many two. times. Boom. And then he's going to attack you for three. Twice. Twice. And we have to place a new steel clan on the board. If the one that you just removed. If it's a, uh, no, no, if we roll one of these. If you roll one of those, yeah. Yeah, which yeah. I'm pretty good at rolling those. All right, let's see. Okay, I get hit twice. Okay. Okay, if that same result happens again, game's over. Yeah. All right. Don't uh, don't let it happen. Don't let that happen again. Oh my gosh! One. One. Okay. One. I will take one. Uh, uh, I don't have a choice, but that is better than <laughs> all the way down. I don't know, Naveen. This it's a long night before daytime. Yeah. So not feeling good. You know, I'm sensing that this is probably the end anyway because we only have one it. one health. But I'm gonna play my card. It's two action points. It's called Hurry, and I can move to any empty space. It doesn't talk about a building restriction, no. so I'm assuming I can just run. I'm, I was in a hurry to climb the Eerie Building. Sure. <laughs> so that's two action points. For my third action point, I'm gonna pick up the eye over here because this is gonna allow me to now have a, um, four actions. Yeah, on your turn, four on my turn. So you basically get an extra action right now. Yes. So you have so two actions left. I have two actions left. And should I just hit him twice? Oh well, no, it's only a two attack, actually. Well, I do have this one right here, so this would be a fourth attack for you. Uh, oh. Two, three, four, because it gives you a plus two strength. Okay, yeah, let's use that skill token. Okay, so do you wanna do your regular attack first, or do you wanna do... Let's do the four attack first. Okay. So I'm gonna attack uh, Xanatos over here right, for well, four. Good luck. Thank you. All so you right. have to spend your skill token. I did, yep. There you go. And uh, I'm going to hope to just... Here we go. Two. Two. Oh, okay. Uh, this might be the time. Yeah, you're going to do a reroll? I'm going to reroll both of these. Okay. Oh, by the way, I have to spend my skill token. Okay. And here's my skill token. And... Uh, good luck. Thanks. Please. Oh, nice. 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 So that is That's four. That's four. And you damage. still have one extra action, so you're just going to do your base action, right? Yes. Uh, do you want to take a free move and stand on top of the disc? Should I go here? I mean, I would be directly adjacent to all these baddies, but I'm just hoping that it doesn't activate the Steel Clan. Yeah, I, I, I don't know. Either way. Either way, it's it's pretty bad. Yeah, because they're going to run up on you and still hit you. So. Okay, I'm going to do it. I'm going to do the as free... As long as you're in, in the same distance for your next hit. Yes. Because you, you must still be within distance of Xanatos. So one... Two. I'm gonna go here. Okay. So that way I'm still technically adjacent to the data disc right. and I can still hit Xanatos. Sure. Okay. So Okay, you just need to roll one uh to survive so we can survive. Yeah. Please. One. one. Okay, perfect. Perfect. Okay, so we're gonna skip a uh We're gonna skip the villain phase. Villain phase. Go back to five. Uh it says that I can place him. Did I just place him in the area building? Do you wanna choose a spot? Should we just bring push him back him as up far there? back as you can? Yeah. Let's go there. Okay. Amazing. Then that's it. That's Goes it. to you. Okay, so I, I drop a card. one health. Uh, okay, I think first action, we just got to get moving. So let's go up one. So we're going to waste one of my movement points. That's, that was two movement two points, points to get there. Yeah, but okay. one action point. And then we're going to go one action point down here. Mm -hmm. Second action point on top of this one right over there. <laughs> 
<laughs> the non-stunned baddie. That Steel Clan member is just like, what? What was yeah, that? Yeah. Something hit me. Yeah. <laughs> All right, what are we? What are we gonna draw here for this? This is. Uh, I, I can only take one hit. This is uh, not good. Yeah, don't don't take the hit. Okay. Objective law. Oh, Xanatos. Okay, okay. He's going to bring the data disk oh back. Oh, my gosh. Xanatos. <laughs> oh. Okay, so he's moving four spaces. It's on top of one, the disk. two. I, I don't think he can hang out on the disk because he has a minion there, so it's going to be right there. That's it. He still moves the disk two spaces. So I'm just going to move it there. It's already there. That is definitely the area building. Yeah. Yes, you are right. Well, that could have been worse. Like we're, we're still alive. We could we could have lost. Yeah, we could have lost. That's true. That's true. <sighs> uh, so, and I'm right there. So I should just move the the data disk. Do what you must. Yeah. Okay. So I are have you, four. Are you gonna move it here and then push it yes. here? Yes. Okay. Cool. So it's gonna go one, two. Yeah. I have two more actions, so I should probably try to attack. Some attack of these. and then bail. Okay, for my third action, I'm going to play a card. This is Aim. Okay. It costs in one action point, but it allows me to hit for an attack strength of three instead okay. of two. And if I roll a lightning bolt, then I can deal two damage. So who are you going to attack? Probably this one. The okay. one that's next yeah. to you. Because you can't take out Xanatos with that. No. There's no physical way. No. Right. Okay. And it'll allow me to move two spaces. So. Uh, Perfect. Two. Perfect. Okay, so it's out. So this Steel Clan member is out, and I can move two spaces. Yeah. So, oh. Yeah, it's not where really good to go. <laughs> Because you can't end up on top of them. Well, then I'm just going to move this way. One, two. Yeah. And attack again, I guess, right? Yeah, I'm going to attack this one. Okay. So for attack strength of two. Two. <sighs> Thanks. Here we go. Two? Two. All right, perfect. So it's taken out. Uh, I said this one, That right? one right there, yep. Okay. And now I have a free... Two move. Two move. And I'm going to run away. Okay. I'm just going to go one, two. two. <laughs> wow. I'm thinking I can try to catch the data disk. Um, on its way this way. As long as I don't take a one damage here or any damage, then 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 we're good. If that I... is a tall order. It is a very tall order. <laughs> this might and be it. Yeah, this might be it. A contingency plan. Hey. Oh. Oh, this is good. I'm yeah, not next to a, a data disk. Fantastic. Okay. Okay. So Xanatos is going to move to F7. That F7 spot that's been killing us. And then finally, for the first time in the entire game, yeah. we're not going to get hit by this because it's only against heroes who are at or adjacent to at least one data and disk. I am not there. And the next time it's oh. going to be daytime. Oh. There's a chance. There's a chance. Okay, Naveen. Okay. It's Just, my turn. It is your turn. I get to draw a card. And uh, run over there and push that data disk. Run and push, you yes. say. Yes. Oh, but keep in mind, during the daytime phase, Xanatos is going to move four spaces towards that data disk. Mm. So if you're going to move it, move it um, that's you know further away than four spaces. Okay, so I'm going to play a card called Heroic Charge, and this one's going to take two of my action points. It allows me to move for three, so we're just going to go uh, one, two, three diagonal, and okay. I can now attack at a strength of four, one away. So this one right over here. So I'm <laughs> going to, yeah, this one, this old Xanato. So I'm going to attack it for four right now. So good luck to us. Yeah, that's All great. Because right. I would like to skip this phase so that it doesn't, uh, he can't just. Right. We assume that if you defeat Xanatos, we'll skip the villain, the villain phase, including the day, day daytime. Because right? I don't, I don't need yeah. technically the health right now. I'll get it on the next one. Cool. Three. Okay. okay. That's three. That's not bad. I don't okay. have a skill token, but hey, that's that's not bad. That's okay. So you just need two. So I have another attack, and then I'm going to just do my... I'm just going to do my regular attack, which is okay. a three. So if again, if I roll a lightning bolt, it's also a success. So okay. four of the six faces are good on all these dice. <laughs> two. All right. Perfect. Oh, okay. Perfect, perfect, perfect. So that's it. That's a that's critical it. hit for Xanatos. That is... That's great. And then that pushes Xanatos. Xanatos back, right? Yes. Xanatos goes back Go to the building. Let's, let's, put him, let's put him here. Oh, let's, all right. Yeah, now that, that Odin's <laughs> eye is gone. Naveen means business. I do. So we're going to skip the whole villain phase, which is fantastic. I do get to draw a card. And now it goes back to me? It goes back to you, yeah. All right. So I'm starting to think that we can do this. <laughs> I'm going to attack the Steel Clan member. Sure. So that it'll give me a free two movement to get towards the data disk. So you still have your three, even though there's this building here. Um, Buildings do not pretty strong. She get can get through a building, yes. Of range. Totally. So, okay. And it would be nice to eliminate the Steel Clan member, yeah, but it would it's be. not, I guess, not super necessary. Sure. We just need it for the free movement. Okay, one hit. <laughs> All right. I shouldn't have said that. I, I should have just said I needed it gone. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. So that's, I get to move twice. So there's two. Okay. And I have, since I have Odin's Eye, 
I can move the, the data disk to three spaces. Yeah. Let's just see where four. One, two, three. Okay, so any movement, really. Yeah, on top of you, probably, right? One, One two, two, three. three. So you just need a mosey over there. I, I need a mosey, yeah, for sure. Oh, I can do it. Well, let's do the daytime phase first. We got to go phase. through. Rules are rules. Yes, rules are rules. Okay. Uh, Xanatos is going to move. So let's see. It's one, two, three, four. Okay. Right? Yes. And then you place three new Steel Clan tokens All right, at the area so building. Let's just put one there. And then we shuffle these. One there. And then we get to and, do. Uh, let's put one over here. Let's we get to do our stuff. I'm just, I'm, I feel like we're going to bring it home. So I think so. I'm just going to do my healing. Yeah. And call it a day, right? Yeah. Oh, wow. I think we can do this. Okay, I'm going to heal. Yeah. <laughs> it was looking real bad. Oh, I like, thought it was uh, over. In two different two different spots. I, I absolutely thought it was over. Okay. Okay. I've healed. Okay. Yeah. I think we can do this. Okay. So I'm going to move. My first action point is going to be uh, one, two. Mm -hmm. Second action point is to just toss this up onto the building. And that's it. That's it. <laughs> the information <laughs> has been kept safe. <laughs> or brought safe? Wow. That uh, was that was quite the capture the flag. Yeah, we got, we got pretty lucky there. That was wow. Three flags and some really strong that that moment where we, we were just totally barricaded and then suddenly all the steel clans activated. That we was, needed them to activate because they were they were so up against that tower that you I felt do like anything about it. It was like a building surrounded by birds and you just throw a rock. <laughs> and like, wow. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, stunning these three was also made me feel more comfortable, even though it technically never we didn't use it. Use it, yeah. But I, <laughs> Well, we're one we step it. closer to saving yes. the day. Good job. We did it. And there you have it. That is Disney Gargoyles Awakening. Thank you all so much for watching our video today. We really hope you enjoyed it. Yeah, we do have plans to be back here in the future for more gameplay videos. But in the meantime, if you want to check out more like this, then you can always check out our channel, which is linked in the description below. And if you enjoyed watching this video, please go ahead and like and subscribe here as well. And if you're interested in solo gaming, Paula has a segment called Table for One on this channel as mm -hmm. well. And until next time, thanks, thanks for, for watching. watching.